Well, hello guys and welcome back to the channel. Glad you could join me again. Today we're looking at the Harbor Freight July Super Coupon Book Part 2. This is not the same as the first video that I did earlier in the month. This is Part 2. Now, you're going to see some items that are the same in this video, but as we scroll further down, you're going to see more newer coupons as we go through. So let me update you on a couple things and I'm going to be scrolling through here and just go past the coupons that we discussed earlier and it all makes sense as I explain it to you. So don't hit cancel, don't go somewhere else, stick around, let me explain everything to you and you'll understand exactly everything that is going on with Harbor Freight. Now basically let me say that uh, you can, if you can't see these coupons clearly, make sure to adjust your video settings to the highest setting because I do shoot this in HD format, so you should have a nice clear shot of the coupon code, the expiration date, the items, everything. But if for some reason you don't because of encoding reasons, uh, these coupons are available at my website and you can get them anytime, ever, you know, anytime you want to at my website. You don't have to rely on this, on this uh, video just to get the coupons. You can go to my website, they're nice large format, you can print them out, you can jot down the coupon code, whatever you want to do. But anyway, to update you on what is going on with Harbor Freight, if you go back a couple of months and watch my videos, you will see that Harbor Freight was releasing coupons once a month and they were good for the entire month. Now what Harbor Freight is doing, remember last video I pointed out that Harbor Freight was being a little weird, that the dates didn't match up and they would go halfway into the month, halfway into the next month, etc, etc. It was a little bit weird. Well, what they have settled on is that now they are releasing coupons at the beginning of the month that are good through the middle of the month. That is what the previous video was about. Then at the middle of the month, they will re-release the coupons with a different coupon code. This is not the same as it was in the previous video. And this one now will expire on the 31st. So the first half of the month, it's the same item, same price, basically the same coupon, but different coupon codes. So they expire on the 15th, and then the, these new coupons pick up from the middle of the month all the way to the end of the month. Why Harbor Freight is doing that? I don't know. I think it's mostly just to get more attention, to get more people talking about their coupons, which is what we're doing now, right? Two videos, same products, etc. But don't stop there. As we scroll down, you're going to see that there are also new coupons that were included. So they release, let, let's look at it this way. They release half their coupons at the beginning of the month, and then they release the same half and another half at the end of the month. So they give you the full amount by the middle to end of the month. So that's what we're going to be looking at. That's why I'm not going into detail on a lot of these items. I'm just scrolling through them so you can see them as I'm talking. But we already talked about most of these items in the previous video, so I'm not going to spend a lot of time on them here. I will go into more detail on the items further down uh, as we get to them for the new coupons that just came out. And that's one thing too that I can tell you that a lot of people on Harbor, uh, a lot of people on YouTube talk about Harbor Freight videos and so forth. Uh, unfortunately, a lot of them have never used a lot of these products, so they really can't give you any good information about the products from Harbor Freight. I have been shopping at Harbor Freight for about 20 years now, and I can tell you everything about Harbor Freight, the good, the bad, etc. I have actual hands-on physical experience, so that's one good reason to sub my channel. That way, when I go over these coupons, if you're curious about a particular item, I will talk about it. I will talk about it at some point or another, and that way you will know if it's a good item to buy or not. And I also track prices very, very closely, so I can tell you what coupons are good and what coupons are not good, what coupons you should stay away from, because I see them come out better. I'm very good at tracking prices. Harbor Freight is one of the places I track, and I will definitely let you know so you don't wind up overpaying. And that's another thing also, like I told you before, and here we go again, this one, this coupon right here, don't use that coupon. Wait for the next one, because it will go down to $39. So you can get it cheaper. Why pay 45 now unless you absolutely need it right now? Wait for the next one. It will go down to $39. So that's one item right there. And that's one thing also that, you know, I talk about the items on these videos, whatever strikes my mind. If I look at this or I look at this and I just say, I'm going to talk about it. But if there's a particular item 
that you want me to talk about, you can go see these coupons on my site from the 1st on the 15th, whenever Harbor Freight puts them out, I will put them on my site for you to be able to, you know, download them, copy them, etc. And you can feel free to send me an email anytime you want and say, hey, Mr. DIY, hey, why don't you talk about the Braun 1250 uh, lumens flashlight? I really want to know more about that. Is that a good price? Should I wait longer? Is it a durable light? And I will be happy to include it in the next video that I produce and talk about that light to satisfy the person that writes me an email and, and wants more information on it. So I'd be happy to do that for you guys. Let's make the video more interactive. You can always make comments down below. Feel free to do that. I will be happy to answer any question that you put down below. But if you want a more direct uh, information about a particular item, feel free to let me know and I will include it in the coupons. So here we go. These are the new coupons for the second part of the month. And let's look a little bit at these. So here we go. The, a, lot of, a lot of these items you will find, they used to be the freebie items, but not all. Okay, some of them. These black flashlights used to be a freebie. This blue flashlight still is a freebie. This used to be a freebie here. And all I can say is don't buy the blue one. It's a freebie unless you're buying a hundred of them. You know, if you're only going to get one, get it as a freebie. Don't pay for it. These black lights, I have found that over time, they are terrible. They will fail. So I will, I would not, I mean, all right, let's put it this way. If you really need a cheap flashlight, go ahead. But I wouldn't buy it, honestly. This one here, I would say I have a video showing you how to turn this simple little flashlight into a bright, powerful headlamp using this blue light. Go check out that video. Tarps at 97 cents, they are very good. I would suggest buying that. Uh, that is a, a good price. I mean, three bucks to, you know, less than a dollar. Not bad at all. Uh, scissors for 39 cents used to be a freebie also. Used to be a freebie on these. It used to be a freebie on these. All used to be freebies. In fact, freebie, freebie, freebie. All of these items so far used to be freebies. And, you know, that's one thing that I am, I will predict that by the end of the year, the freebies will pretty much disappear. It's already down to only the blue light. But I would say even that one is going to disappear over time. Uh, maybe they'll do it like, um, you know, like, you know how some like McDonald's or some restaurants will have like a special item that will come back for a limited time. I think that's what Harbor Freight is going to do. They're going to get rid of the freebies and then every so often, maybe every blue moon, they'll bring back special free item that way to get you to go in. But the days of the freebies are limited and pretty much going to disappear. These guys right here, the seven piece combination ratcheting wrench, these guys are very good. I have a set of these. I've been using them for a long time and I find them to be very durable. I mean, the only way to break these guys, and they do have a lifetime warranty. The only way to break these guys is if you put a five foot cheater bar on it, then you, know, you could probably break them. But in normal use, they're not gonna break. And look at right here, $39 for a Predator, uh, uh, what is that, a generator? Wow, well, wait a minute, hold on. Look a little closer. <laughs> it's only the handle you're not talk about clickbait that is not what you're getting to put that image but you're only buying the handle for 39 bucks so they kind of get you a little bit overexcited on that one uh this central forge uh multi-purpose vice uh, it's mediocre uh it, it will break it's cast iron if you abuse it it'll break so you know i'd say buy a better one for that price you can afford to buy a better a better uh product um you know, this uh, V-shape hangout for a buck, hey, that, that's a bargain. You know, why not? 250 for these guys right here, that's not bad. These magnets, I have a bunch of them, and they are strong. In fact, I would say, if you're stacking these guys together, which I have, I've made them into a big pile, be careful. I pinched my finger one time because they grab on so tight, it really gave me a heck of a blue mark on my finger. Oh, that hurt so much. These guys right here, really good deal. I use them in all my uh, uh, impact wrench torture videos and they have not failed me yet. So these guys are very, very good. Now this right here, this Bauer electric pressure washer, this is a new item. They just came up with this not too long ago and I haven't used it yet. But one thing I would say about this, like I says right there, new. One thing I would say about this uh, as an electric pressure washer, $179 seems a little steep to me. Even 219 is outrageous. but. Uh, you're paying for the Bauer name, but stop and think about it. it it's 2,000 PSI. You can get their green one, which used to be their blue one, but you can get their green one, the electric one, that has 1,700 PSI, and that's only 75 bucks. 
on sale with a coupon. So 75 bucks versus 179, why would you pay an extra 100 bucks more for 300 PSI more? That doesn't make any sense to me. I mean, they're trying to make this up to the point of being like a, a gas pressure washer, but those generally run 3,000, 4,000 PSI. And those are generally in the two to 300, $400 range. So I think this item is not a very smart one to buy for a consumer. I'd say if you're, if you're gonna look at that, look at the green one, that's a much better deal. I have the old blue version and it is a very good machine. I still have it years later and it works just fine. And here we are, tarps. We, you already saw another one that was cheaper than that. And these are a good price. The hose I don't recommend. And here we are at the end of the coupon uh, video, dudes. And if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And be able to check back here anytime. And I'll have new videos for you about coupons and other stuff. So I'll talk to you guys on the next one. Bye-bye for now.